Hello, this is Kent Sussex Restoration. We've now finished the burning off. As you can see, it's all burnt off and I've loosely hung it back up just so it's off the ground and drying or out of the weather, I should say. Now, as you can see at the bottom, we need to rehang all the board and fix it with galvanized nails, not bright because that will come through in the paintwork. And uh, yes, they like that should be done today. Ready for the priming. Happy days. Here we go. Uh, here's some um, rather nice wattle and daub panels from the original building. Uh, it was built, I think, in 1720 or thereabouts, 1750. And this is all the original panels, oak frame, and wattle and daub, lard and plaster, well, lars, then the daub on top, and it would have been lime washed. And uh, you see it on quite a few old buildings, but not the original door, because it's all cement now these days, which is horrible. But yes, what lovely stuff. A few wasps have made their homes, obviously, but best thing to do is cover it up and let it be. Let's preserve it for what it is. It's a shame it can't be looked at, but never mind. It's not the day we'd live in today, I suppose. Lovely. Yes, we've now um, put on the paint. Uh, sorry, we now put on two coats of paint, but as um, it's opaque, um, Demi Deck, it needs to, with Mike Porus, it needs three coats to cover um, freshly burnt off boards. So we've primed it, put two coats on, and now this is the third coat going on. Just a little tip, um, when you come to paint, um, when you're painting, don't paint at the top. Ooh, don't paint at the top paint at the bottom and work your way up. That's probably the better way to do it. I should just quickly show you up here. <clears throat> All fun and games. So yes, so what we want to do, work down on, work off the uh, weathered edge. Oops, work off the weathered edge and work your way up to the feather. And repeat, do not start at the top and work down because the paint will build up here and not here where the weather is affecting it more so and will wear away the paint so start at the bottom build the paint up nicely so you have a nice even coat if a little bit more on this edge than that edge so you don't need it under here you need it here hope that's good for you and uh, enjoy long lasting weatherboard <coughs> much so more than traditional methods Cheers, bye. 